Hello and welcome back everybody uh, to Minecraft. Uh, today we are going to be clearing a lot of trees. Um, not really building too too much but actually I want my ladders if I have any left. <laughs> um, so that I can get up the walls over there a lot easier. Yes, no, yes. Kind of. We'll use we'll use some of the wood here to make some more ladders. Um, but yeah, we're going to be prepping for the first wing to be created, and that's just simply the mining slash tinkers wing. So it's not going to be too terrible much. But oh, that's right, not that. <laughs> but um. But yeah, uh, we'll be also attempt to get the smeltery together because we need a place to start breaking down uh, cobblestone into smooth stone and smooth stone so that we can get the smooth stone into bricks so that we can start at least building up the um, walls. Dick, 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 left, right, left, right, ow. Okay, that did not work. Um, okay, let's run. I'm going to need some of the more advanced digging tools for uh, up there because see that big spire piece at the end right there? Yeah, that's going to have to go. Um, but it looks like most of the rest of that spot would be perfect for what we're looking for. So, Okay. Shreeman, shreeman, shreeman. Hello, squiddos. The lag always happens, like, right here, too. Which is interesting. Um, come on, hop. Only for a second. Hmm. To the moon! Easiest way to go up anything, just bring a bunch of ladders. Uh, we're running out of ladders, though. This is really high up. And we're to the top. Um, why, hello, cows. Um, I is hungry. And let's get to chopping, actually. Um, thank you. I might actually just, oh gosh, that was much further down than I thought it was. Actually, I'll just, uh, kind of fast forward through this part and, uh, yeah, I'll see you once I'm done. Uh, eating all the trees. <laughs> See you then. Okay, I think that's all we can do right here for now. Um, 
It did become night, so this is a little scary. Kind of funny that there's like a river right there. <laughs> um, down, 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 down. Ooh, just missed. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> um. Yeah, it's like when I cross right there, specifically right there, that all the lag always happens. Don't want none, Zombro. Mm. I'm gonna run out of food so fast now because of that fall, though. Uh oh, Creeper, run! Ha! Get across that, Creeper! Swimming, swimming, swimming. But, yeah, so... The furnace system I'm going to set up will be heavily automated using... Um, primarily just vanilla stuff. I actually got the idea from the mod uh, Roguelike, where their dungeons... Um... The randomly spawn dun dungeon, well not randomly, the, it has room pieces which will spawn together randomly. But, they're, what, what monsters? Really, Zombro? This isn't doing much more than punching him. Wood. What about this? Yeah, really? Come on, just die. Okay, thank you. Um. Oh dear. Ow! Oh dear goodness, that's gonna require a lot of materials to fill back in. Ugh. Okay, close that. Go to sleep. Um. What? <laughs> that was... That was truly a, um... A uh, unique occurrence. I'm surprised I didn't die from that creeper explosion, though. But we are out of food now. Um, let's see if we can't actually pick up that zombie meat. Ooh, there's two as well. Um. Okay. Um. We will make ourselves another couple drying racks. That way we can actually get both made at the same time. Hmm. Creepers, am I right? There we go. Uh, don't need snowballs right now, they're just cluttering my inventory. Okay, now what I think we're going to do is we're going to make the uh, some of the higher tier other items. Let me grab the moss real quick because we're going to want to moss them up. So, we're going to want sticks. Four sticks, four wood. Okay, and we don't need the rest of this wood for anything, so... We are out of sword space to do anything about that, so. Uh, let's make another chest. Uh, that's two chests. Oops. <laughs> that's fine. We can always use chests. Um, put this down here and just drop all of this wood in here. Uh, we need those two. <laughs> um... Yeah. All right, let's... Um, second chest. Uh, if I put it right there, I won't be able to access the one underneath. Ah, just right there. That's fine. Probably not, but it's fine for now. Um, so, what we're going to want to do is we, we need more stencils. 
Because if you remember last time, we... Oh, wait, but we made more, didn't we? We did. So we didn't actually need that much more. Ugh. Oh, well, that's fine. Uh, we need an excavation head, a hammer head. And actually getting a sword right now would not be half bad. So let me go get that moss again and actually some wood to make those uh, uh, the handle and crossbar not crossbar binding pieces okay so we're gonna need 8 16 24 um, 24 32, 32, 48, we are going to need a lot of bronze, 48 bronze, holy cow, do we even have enough to make 48, I'm going to need 310 per, so 48 divided by 4 is 12. 12 times 3. We don't even have enough tin or copper. We have plant. We have enough tin. Um, actually, just barely. Uh, it's going to take all but two of the tin. So what we're going to do first is we're going to make the hammer, which is actually one of the more costly pieces. So that should be enough for the hammer. Oh, dear. I don't have any of the um, other materials I required. I need casts. <laughs> I did not make any. Well, that that's going to be troublesome. Anyways, uh, we can make some of those casts, or the pieces that would eventually make the casts right now. Kind of doing all this out of order. That's one, two, and three. Nope, not that one. This one. There. Okay. Got casts for two of the, or not casts, but templates. Then we put these down here. Once this is melted up, we will actually make two of these plates. And then we're going to just have to. Um, Actually, let's see if the aluminum bronze drops beneath the uh, bronze. Because if it does, then I can make a cast before uh, all of the casts before I have to use up the bronze. But if I remember right, whatever goes in last goes in on top. Yeah. Okay, so simple enough. We're going to have to empty all all eight. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um, okay, well, so, so I'm kind of in a pickle at the moment. Um, I don't have enough to necessarily recreate that evenly. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to just drain the bronze into there. And so we'll be able to make these templates. <gasps> Wait, maybe I didn't have to. Maybe it would have taken them out in, um, on its own. Actually, let's, yeah, I need that one. So let's make sure that's there before I toss those out because that would be very bad. <laughs> Um, but we can take that and this, and hopefully our bronze will be on the bottom. Now we need that one, so we'll take this one, throw these two in here for the time being, uh, throw that one out. We are actually hungry, so let's check on our jerky. Nom, nom, nom. 
Um, it's an easier way of making food, but as you see, that food does not do a lot. So unless you're killing zombies left and right, you're not really going to get a ton of food from it. So, okay, good. The bronze is on the bottom, so we can fill this up the rest of the way. Bing. There we go. And since there's still bronze on the bottom, we'll actually need all of this eventually anyway, so we might as well just throw it all back in. But so what we're planning on doing here is we're going to make a hammer um, so that we can dig faster, a lot faster. And that way we can get the rest of the materials, we, the rest of the copper and such that we need for uh, the other tools. Uh, we do not have enough moss, though, for all of them. Yes, we do. Um, well, no, I would rather the moss on the sword because we run into creatures a lot more than we dig up stuff, um, with shovels. So, okay, let's make the bronze head. In fact, let's make the tough rod, which requires three, which is kind of an off end amount because now I have that left over. <laughs> And pick that up and let's craft it. So hammerhead, that, and then that, that. I kind of know it by memory, kind of. Um, it always goes the tool head, the tool handle, excuse me, hiccuping, and then what other, other, other pieces. And since on the hammer, the two other pieces were simply the same piece, I just split them up over the, that. If it was something like the axe, or as you'll see when I make the shovel, I will be actually having the shovel template open because, yeah, <laughs> I don't know which of the extra parts go where. Because I believe there's a binding and a, um, one of the plates. So, that looked very dark. Let's lighten you up a bit anywho now to show off the majesty of this hammer so we go down to a point in which we wish to dig I will say let's not make it too far and let's leave one space though so we want to go two over from that because it digs out three by threes and we're not gonna make this too fancy because we're just trying to dig it out so there. Actually, let's reorganize this a little. Um, redstone. We're actually going to need quite a bit of redstone um, for making secret passages and stuff because we need uh, pistons and stuff like that. So, ah, more copper. Okay, we have plenty of room. Um, for a second there, I thought I was running out. <laughs> so we need like 36 copper. Um, so that's, whoa. Um, I, I'd prefer not. Or, well, might be a good idea kind of come up here well maybe not actually because I don't have any I thought I heard something okay we are leaving um I don't have my uh weapon yet so we will actually continue in this direction just on the side of the dirt oh dear and then that opens up to it the problem is, is if I leave that open, something's going to drop in and kill me. And as, as much fun as it would be for you guys, I do want to promote a more sustainable playing style where you're not dying all the time. <laughs> or should I say, I'm not dying all the time. Um, 
Ooh. Oh. Why? Hello, lava. Nice to meet you. Uh, we will actually dig around that in a little bit. Um, we do kind of want to save the iron, too. So. Ah, copper. How much do we have? We have 11. <laughs> Not nearly the uh, number we need. Um, but. Okay, we now have 17. So we can actually make another item. Uh, some sapphires to make pseudo armor out of. If there's enough of them. It's five. Uh, put a block over right there. Actually, I should do something similar over here so that I don't just like. Do, 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 do. Ah! Then, uh. Well, that would be the end of it, now wouldn't it? Wow, coming across a lot of this Ars, Ars Magica uh, crystals. We do need to start that too, but I need to make a book to be able to collect from the um, magic pool. And, uh, well, actually with Tinkers, it's really easy to make a book, but I have no patience to make one right now. I need uh, paper and such, so. Oh gosh, this cave. I'm actually half tempted to just go uh, lava trenching, which is where you dig around the lava pool at a height equal to it. So basically, if you d dug into it, you would uh, drown yourself in lava. But, um. Yeah, we're running out of space. But, actually we do need more aluminum, because we will need more casts here in a moment. Ooh, well, okay, here's the predicament. I need the copper over there. <laughs> so, kind of pseudo lava trenching, since it kind of brought me up to that point anyways. Oh, actually, I did not need to do that. This is not quite lava trenching. I would dig one more down and then dig around the perimeter of the lava. Okay, that's just shard. Oh, oh dear. Yeah, we're going to be covering that back up. In fact, let's do that to make it safe. Um... But it is actually a smart idea that if you have no way... Ooh, see, that's why. <laughs> I was about to say, just in case there's lava just below, it's actually safe not to stand on the thing that you're digging out. And as I'm talking, it proves me right. Oh, Ventium. We will actually need this for... Uh... No! <laughs> Ventium! You died so young. Anyways... Uh, to make quite a bit of the magic in Ars Magica. Okay, I guess I'm doing this. Nothing nothing show up because I don't have any weapons to stop you. Okay, I'm out of torches. And I'm low on food. And my thing is actually almost full. Actually, it's probably not good for my back to be turned that way. Um, more Ventium. I hear is I heard a zombro. Um, ooh, some copper. Uh, how much do we have? Twenty six. That should actually be enough because remember we used a good bit. Oh, and some more. We used a good bit already to make the hammer, so technically we did not need the full thirty six from there. Or after the hammer on. After the hammer, we would actually need less than that because the hammer took up more than two. Maybe we do need some more. Anyways, but 
Oh, <laughs> well, if we need more, we just found it. <laughs> um, so let's dig all of that up. Very nice. Okay, I think we we definitely have enough now, because remember we did have that extra that we threw in to try to balance the my mistake in the uh, order of how I should have created the things. So, um, yeah. <laughs> and there's some more copper right there, of which I will actually get. Dicka 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 dicka. But uh, there is some behind the ladder. I will not be digging that up yet, though. That will be more if I start getting very desperate. But oh, why? Hello. What I'm going to do here is... Actually, that's two steps up, so that should not be accessible. So no monster should be able to get into that, and I will have a nice little entrance to a cave. So if we get back up to the top, it's probably going to be nighttime, so we're probably going to sleep. Uh, we may organize everything first so that we get the maximum daylight. Yep. Sun looks like it's just going down so that is somewhere else we can put that with itself uh five we can make ourselves a helmet we can make ourselves a helmet <laughs> um and all of the non-smelting ores or not ores but stone um, I don't, no, we need more wood because we need more handles and binding picks and stuff like that, so. Aluminum, tin, tin, copper, copper. Okay, just making sure all of that's good. Did we have any of that poor gold over here? No. Okay. Oh, no, it's becoming daytime. Right? Yep, that is rising. Okay, so let's first of all correct the mistake we made, which would be to add one more copper. Because we had two. Yeah, I think one more copper. And that should turn this into eight ingots. Okay, and then, and then, and then, well, actually, let's put some of this back. Just shift click it in there so it goes where it wants to. Then we can organize it. Um, we'll use that one first. One. We threw two in there, so that's. Eight on top of the twenty four, so we need thirty two more. So we, oh, oh gosh, I'm yawning this morning. <laughs> I, I do apologize deeply. So nine, eight, because we're gonna have th that four. And that's going to be 12, so we're going to need four here. So, yeah, that should fill it out. Uh, we don't need this cast anymore. We do need this one, this one, and this one, though. So, and each of those require its own uh, plate. That requires two sticks. That's a binding and a stick. Yeah. Okay, then. Um, actually, let me grab that other moss. Um, doo -doo. We will be digging out a lot, though. So if we can find another one of those or some more mossy stone, we do need to pick that up quite a bit. So let's craft these 
24. Yes. Okay. So, actually, that might be a little too much now that I think about it. Because each of them needs one. And I am actually running out of food quite desperately. <laughs> um, while that's working, let's actually make some of the tough bindings. Uh, that would make three, four. We're going to have one left over, I think, still. So we needed one, two, three, and then a tough binding. And then pour more. We will make ourselves a sapphire helmet. Just got me blue. No, just uh, I am blue. To, blue Abudita. Is that how it goes? Blue Abudita. Anywho. <laughs> okay, there are some berries down there. There's a bunch of berry bushes going off that way. So that's probably what we're going to do as we head over to the upper place up over there to start actually digging out the. Um, I don't think I needed that one, but we'll have an extra plate. That's fine. We'll, we'll find a use for it. Um, now then. A, one of those. Yeah, see, I'm going to need this for it because I'm not sure how that's going to order out. And then get some moss on it. Then the shovel, I don't care as much for so we will moss it up a little later but that looks good now we have a weapon a shovel and an axe of tier two um now it is now i do want to reiterate that the tier twos you should you should still keep tier ones because the tier twos, um, though powerful, do have drawbacks. So, in that they have to dig out an area. So, okay, we're going to cut down this tree and then we'll head over and start flattening the area on the other side. Mm, but the time, it seems like this episode is running out of time and we are coming to an end. So,. Uh, I hope you liked the episode. Uh, subscribe if you want to make sure to, that you'll catch the next one when it comes out. Um, leave a like if you've been enjoying the uh, the show so far. Um, and it tells me because it tells me that you want to see more. So if you want to see more, be sure to like. Um, and leave a comment in the comment section below if you have anything to suggest at all such as mods for um, the next Minecraft or maybe a mod that I might be able to add into this before it gets too deep into it. So, uh, yeah, make sure to leave that those comments. Um, and I will see you in the next one. Thank you. Have a good one.